everybody. Hope you're all doing well. We are finally putting the Roomba J7 Plus through the pickup test. Usually I put down 7.6 ounces of debris. Now I'm gonna lower that to five and start recording all the different videos on five ounces. The reason being is because a lot of these robot vacuums dirt bins don't really hold that much debris. So they're going around and not picking up as much as they potentially could. Especially ones with a really small bin, such as like a uh, <coughs> Shark IQ or the <coughs> Shark AI. Those barely even hold the five ounces. So we're going to go ahead and do five ounces from now on. It's still a ton of debris. That's going to be a little bit more accurate, I think. And I will probably wind up retesting all the robots and letting you know exactly which one is the best on a pickup test. So I put down the five ounces already. It's basically Fruit Loops, uh, white rice, and then a little bit of sand is mixed in. Very little bit of sand. But it's right at five ounces, and we're gonna see how much this guy will pick up. If you're new to this channel, please smash that like button for me. I try to do a lot of work on this channel for you guys to give you the best options for robot vacuums. I even built this custom room. It's got six different surfaces. This is thick carpet, medium density, kind of a thin standard carpet, carpet tiles, a hard surface, and then even tile with grout. So I'd really appreciate the smashing the like button for me. I'm gonna try to get back to pumping out videos every other day or so like this. I've been so busy lately, I just haven't had the time to do the normal content you've been seeing. So get ready for lots of videos. And let me go ahead and set you up with the overhead view and we will send this guy out and I'll let you know how long it took to clean this area. And then we'll weigh the bin at the end and we'll see exactly how good it is. So this J7 starts off with kind of a weird pattern right off the gate. Not sure why this is not mapped the area yet, but in the end it doesn't seem to actually matter because well, you'll see at the end of the video.
All right, everybody, it is done. It took exactly 30 minutes to do this room. This was the first time it's cleaned this room, so there was no map. And uh, let's just go ahead and find out real quick how well it did on the pickup test. As you can see, I took out the bag, that way it wouldn't empty itself. And now we can just take out the dirt bin, weigh the contents, and then see exactly how much it picked up. go. So this ball itself weighs 0.5 ounces. So we have to take that off whatever this says right off the get go. So as you can see, 5.3, so minus the half ounce, we're at 4.7, I'm sorry, 4.8 ounces out of five. That is actually really, really good. So let's see what it missed. It really just missed a few Fruit Loops, which I'm surprised it missed Fruit Loops. That's usually something that's really easy for these to pick up. But as far as the rice itself, on pretty much all these surfaces, it did very good. There's a little bit of rice here and there, but overall, for one run, that is an excellent job. 4.8 is actually way up there. All right, guys, so once again, I'm going to start doing exactly five ounces. We'll start comparing them all from that amount. That way, these bins don't get over full. I know some of them maybe have in the past test. So this is just going to be all that more accurate. All right, guys, if you enjoyed that video, please smash that like button. Don't forget to subscribe on your way out. I got a lot more videos coming and a lot more fun tests. I have over 50 robot vacuums now, which is just crazy. I don't even have room. I mean, take a quick look. <laughs> My robot graveyard. There's all the boxes. So I'm going to try to get this area nice and cleaned up, have all my robots nicely stacked over here somewhere against this wall, and even start recording videos down here of like the unboxings and all that. So once again, I hope you guys enjoy that. Well, that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Thanks again for watching. Have an awesome day, and I'll see you in the next one.